uh this is a double question on uh permutations combinations and counting methods it's a very conceptual question it's not difficult but it's a little takes a little time getting used to it let's see s p the set of all pairs i j where i is greater than equal to 1 i is less than j and j is less than equal to n and n is greater than equal to 4 any two distinct members of s are called friends if they have one constituent of the pairs in common and enemies otherwise so here given an example for n is equal to 4 the set which can be formed are 1 2 1 3 1 4 2 3 2 4 3 4 from four members take any two at a time so that will be 4 c 2 similarly if you have n members n n uh, numbers right if for any value of n the number of pairs which can be formed in this set will be nc2 number of elements in s will be nc2 each of them will be a pair of two members right okay further we have this concept of enemies and friends right so you have friends if you have one element common your enemies if you have no element common So one two and one three are friends. One two and two three are friends, but one four and two three are enemies because they have nothing in common. Okay, so let's look at the question. In general, n how many enemies will each member of S have? How many will have each member of S? How many enemies will he have? You need to find enemies, which means nothing should be in common. So if you have a and b as the elements, you need to form sets. Which does not have a in it does not have b in it. How many such sets can be formed? Right now, overall there are n elements out of which two elements are already gone. You cannot use these two. Right, so you can form sets using n minus two elements. How many will have each? How many members does each pair have? Two. Right, so these many pairs will have will be enemies of S. Right, so let's calculate this. This will be n minus two into n minus three by two, which will be n square minus five n plus six by two. Option D will be our correct choice. All right, let's see the second one. Okay, for a general n, consider two members of S that are friends. how many other members of s will be common friends of both these members okay so to have to be friends you need to have one element common so if you have one such set will be a b n a c now your question is how many other members will be friends of both these members you need to be friends of both these members okay now if the common element is b right the only way you can have friendship with this will be b c if the common element is b the only way you can make friendship with the second set is if the set is b c similarly if the common element is c then the only way you can make friendship with the other one will be b c again right okay so if the uncommon member has to be common friend right the, the set should be comprised of the two uncommon members that is one way possible if you have b bc will be one friend if you see the common member between the two friends then the set has to be bc again because that is the only way you can have another well in common with ab okay now if the common member for the friend is a common member is a then you need to form a set with a as one member the other member should not be b or should not be c because we already have taken b and c right so out of n people one person a is gone you cannot use b you cannot use c so you can have n minus 3 sets for example if you have 6 this number was 6 okay so let's see how many friends you will have Okay, so one, two, and one, three are friends, right? How many common friends will both of them have? One friend will be two and three. The other friends will be anyone which has one in it. Okay, 
Now one two is already counted. One three is already counted. So we can have one four, one five, and one six. So n minus three members form a set where n one me one member is the common member. The other member is one which is not used. Right? One you cannot use one. You cannot use two. You cannot use three. So n minus three members here. So how many common how many common friends they have? N minus three here and one common friend here. So n minus two common friends will be there. Option D will be our correct choice. You can also take some number like six, seven, like we did here, and solve and see which number six or seven or five s solves this. That is another way of solving this set. That finishes this question.